it's your favorite guy. Once again, back at it again. Thank you for tuning in. Like, share, subscribe. Hit that ding button for notifications. It's Mr. Omar. Now I'm back at it again. Another deck profile. As you can see, I've piloted Spriggins. I also have piloted a good deck. One of my favorites, Solomon Greats. But since tier limits have definitely been knocked out, I've definitely been piloting one of my favorite decks. And I have to say, I've had this deck on the track, but this is uh, 2.0. I'm going to let y'all guys know, it's still spicy. It's still running the meta. Now that tier limits is out the way, we can definitely just have our way with it. And I can pretty much say, it's a breath of fresh air. So, I want to let you know, your favorite guy is uh, coming at you with the Soul Sword build 2.0. It's spicy. It got new tech support. So, hey, let's get ready to get into the deck profile. Come on, take a trip with Mr. Omar on this journey. You just might learn something. Let's get it. Yes, indeed. We run three copies of Strategist Long Yuan, three copies of Moye, one of my favorites, Soul Sword Taya. We run only two copies. You have to run the All Spikes. I love this effect because it banishes. In the new tech, the Abyss Dragon Sword Soul, which is a very, very nifty effect. Now we're going to float over to our teams. The Tingy, the Pashuda, two copies, three at Horror, and three at Shuna. Let's flow on downward. You have to have the two copies of Incredible Ecclesia, two copies of Effect Failure. It's not that powerful, but I still dig it. Two copies of Ash Blossom. Yes, indeed, the Ash Blossom. Yes, indeed, not one, not two, but three copies of Sorcero Blackout. What I love about this card is that people underestimate the card. Just by banishing this card by any means can trigger off great effects, especially to generate the token. And we only run two copies of Infinite and Permanence. Yes, indeed, the one of Call by the Grade. Can't go wrong with Geki. Vessel of the Dragon Cycle. Power of Desires. Now let's swing over. You must run three copies of Soul Sword Emergence. Two copies of Soul Sword Summit. Heavenly Dragon Cycle times two. Can't go wrong. You got the two copies of Shishao. One copy of Supreme Sovereign Chinging. The Beauty, the Soul Source Sinister Sovereign Quailing Long Yuan. Let's fold over. We got our Tingies. Shaman of the Tingy, Apollosa, and yes, indeed, the Monk. When you have those tokens or any token of the kind, Graveyard bounce effects. Let's follow to our Yang Zines. We have the brightness. We got the Yazi. We got the Phantom of the Yang Zine. One of my favorites to start us. I don't care what most decks, all they do is love to destroy. Try to destroy this one, DP. The Ruby Red Dragon. And last, can't forget the Draco Berserker of the Tingy. Pop, go up, negate, banish. Now, ladies and gentlemen, that was my favorite Soul Sword 2.0. I like the deck. I like the way it combos off. 
once again with Tillium is out the way this deck can prosper again now I will be taking it back to my locals to do some more damage uh, I just want to thank you for allowing me to download this into your system it's a pleasure to bring you these deck profiles these combo tutorials and definitely having you the viewer base subscribe to my channel I'm going to tell you main three reasons you should subscribe to this channel one thing I'm always bringing fresh and hot new content the second thing I'm passionate about what I do and what I put out and the third thing you decide but I just want to tell you thank you I appreciate you for letting me download this into your system once again like share subscribe hit that notification bell leave a comment I always respond back and y'all be blessed peace